Hi there, and welcome back to the Save It For Parts channel. It's currently June in Minnesota, which apparently means it's midsummer. It's like 100 degrees outside, there's this massive heat blob just floating across the state, roasting everything in sight. The whole next week is supposed to be just miserable. It's so hot that my camera is fogging up right now because I just brought it from the nice air-conditioned house out to the garage to do a video, and now the entire camera is condensing and may or may not short out. So for somebody like me who's originally from Alaska, this weather is just terrible. And I want nothing to do with the outside world when it's this hot. Let's make some kind of a outfit or suit that can keep me comfortable outdoors. Now, fortunately, a friend of mine just gave me this uh, expired hazmat suit, which I think probably still has some structural integrity to it. We also coincidentally have this uh, air supply filter device, which may or may not work. And if we're keeping that thing inflated with air, why not uh, refrigerate that air? Have a mobile air conditioning suit. So let's see what's in this hazmat deal. Well, this thing sure looks cool. It's a darker color, so it's not completely ideal as an air conditioning suit because it is going to soak up some uh, radiation from the sun. But, um, yeah, I think we might be able to do something with this. Alright, I feel definitely ready to invade Mars. Some people have given me a hard time for wearing socks with sandals. What's the uh, etiquette on hazmat suits with sandals? I don't know how you get back out of these things again. Let's see what's up with this deal. Sounds like there's some Tic Tacs in there. And of course this thing has some stupid proprietary fastener system that they thought was really, really cool like 30 years ago. Alright, so the blower on this unit is shot, so I'm going to have to uh, either fix this or reinvent it to some extent. To replace that busted blower system, I'm going to use some of the obvious parts. An old duffel bag, an old briefcase, whatever this is, and a gaming computer. Is this not what everyone thinks of when you think uh, portable blower unit? Oh, we'll also use a spare drill charger. So it turns out these little computer fans are not quite powerful enough to inflate that thing or keep a good amount of airflow moving. So I'm actually going to rip these out and I'm going to replace them with this turbo blower that I was using on my aluminum smelter, but I think I'm going to go with uh, propane on that aluminum thing so I don't need this anymore. And it moves a lot more air a lot faster. Alright, it's a heck of a lot louder now, but uh, it stays more inflated, too. I could make a wacky, waving, inflatable hazmat guy. Alright, so now you're asking, where's the air conditioning part of this suit? Uh, how are you cooling the air? Where's the condenser and the coils and all that stuff? Well, I'm going to cheat. I'm just going to take a whole bunch of frozen water bottles, mount them in the bottom of this backpack case, and then the uh, air coming across will theoretically get colder and then be distributed through the suit. I'm also going to throw this uh, remote thermometer system in there, maybe mount it inside the faceplate, and then I can have a few of these uh, remote sensors around so I can tell my temperature at different parts of my body and then outside the suit.
Well, this thing definitely feels cooler inside. I can't hear anything because the fan is just blasting away, but uh, it is keeping me cooler than the outside world for sure. All right, got my little sensor set up here. It is really hot outside in the sun. That's that first sensor. Second sensor is right inside of my little air pack. And then this bottom one is right at my face here. So it's uh, terribly hot outside in the sunshine, but it's nice and comfortable here in the suit. So now that I have the suit keeping me comfortable in this harsh southern climate, I can go outside in the summer and do everyday normal Minnesota things. So the AC suit technically works, um, it's still pretty uncomfortable to roam around in it, and it's really impractical. So uh, this isn't going to be an everyday thing, it's more of a joke video, um, but it is kind of a fun AC suit. Now I have to go change because there's condensate dripping down my legs. Thanks for watching, we'll see you next time.